Another day, another dollar. We are on boy Jermaine, and this morning I'm getting the morning started off with this guy right here. Yo, it's Mike Dean, the first ride show driver ever. The city. Just live streaming with Mike. Look at this he's, dude. He's he's doing his vlogging thing, and I'm doing my kind of entertainment slash reporting. You know the <laughs> usual. And uh, yes, I mean no, I couldn't. Yo, so I know a lot of my subscribers out there are like Uber, Lyft, Postmates, all these other sharing economy platforms. Whoa. Um, but there's another company out there by the name of Juno. It's another um, ride share platform that started here in New York. And slowly but surely they're going to expand across the U.S. Right now, um, Mike and I, Mike Dean, the first ride share driver ever. We're going to take a Juno ride and see how that goes. I've never taken a Juno ride before. I believe you get $10 off your first Juno ride, and uh, maybe I'll take my first ride, and Mike Dean here will take his first ride, and uh, yeah, we'll tell you guys about how that goes. Yo, Mike, who you on the phone with? You speaking too much truth. <laughs> Gotta share the love, baby. Gotta share the love. vlogging a little up here in New York. Uh, it's joined every... Uh, so I get this phone call a couple of days ago, about maybe a week ago. Right now, just requested the first Juno ride, and the driver is one minute away, so we better go upstairs and uh, get this ride started. Juno? Are you Juno? Oh, okay, I'm, I'm Jermaine. Just waiting on my friend here. Uh, thanks for picking us up, man. Uh, so, I'm sharing this ride with my boy, Jermaine Ellis. <laughs> Both my, my made up, ran into each other here in, where are we? New York City, all the way from San Francisco. Yeah, New York City, tell me about it. It is chilly out there. So, uh, uh. we do Uber Lyft uh. and um, Uber Eats. Mm -hmm. And I've heard a lot about Juno. So this is like, this, we're in a Juno, right? But Juno is better than Uber. You we we know. <laughs> <laughs> That's why we're taking so, a Juno. So tell me. I, I have also Uber, but uh -huh. I, don't, I don't prefer with Uber. Uh huh. I just uh, like it. Take out 10%? Yeah. Only 10%? 10%, yeah. Wow, I know Uber takes up to like 30% yeah, th in some markets. 35, 35, 35, 35, 35, yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Well, you know, the 10% is for two years. It's two years. 24 I know, months, I know. yeah. But that's a nice little welcome there, yeah. huh? <laughs> Plus, you get the equity, right? So, um, are you a full time Uber Lyft? Uh, yeah, yeah. Uber? I work with full time, yeah. Juno and Get. Okay. And sometime Uber. Right, right. So you got to mix and match, but you're yeah, definitely st sticking on the Juno platform. Yeah. How do you how do you see the Juno business growing here in San Francisco? Is it becoming uh, New is, York? Is it, is it not I'm sorry. I'm so, I'm so in San Francisco, man. <laughs> I, I haven't made it here to New York. Sorry, Sonny. Yeah. <laughs> so tell me. Uh, hopefully, they'll be coming to San Francisco soon, right? Yeah. So uh, how's the demand growing? Is it getting busier on the Juno platform? Yeah, it's getting. Busy. It is. Yeah, it is. Oh, cool. Cool. It's getting busy. All right, and uh, what about other drivers? Uh, do they seem to be happy as well with you? Yeah, every driver is happy with you. Know? Wow, yeah. wow. This uh, this could be a little dangerous for Uber here, especially in the New York City market, huh? Yeah. When did you start with Juno? Two months before. Two months? And then yeah. how did you, I mean, did you like try it out and then just 
stop doing Uber? Or? I, I just try. I just try the Juno and I really like it. So I just stopped the Uber and now working with Juno. Uh, Cause we, I really want Juno to come to San Francisco. Yeah, it's really, really good for the driver and also for the passenger too. They give the discount for the passenger like thirty five percent, I guess. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Five or thirty. Something. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, they 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 announced so it. You guys in, from California? Uh -huh. Yeah, San Francisco. Yeah, so drivers can sign up anywhere in the U.S. It doesn't mean that they're going to be there anytime soon. It's just that they're getting prepared. You know. So you both guys working with you over? Yep. Um, oh, you both like do it? Uber, Lyft. Like it? Uber, Lyft, Sidecar, Caviar, Postmates, oh, yeah. Fast Rabbit, <laughs> Uber, Uber Eats, DoorDash. That's loud, man. Yeah. We hustlers. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you gotta get a flavor for all of them. You know, so you do get too, don't you? I get, I do get. Now I, I hear get is getting a little slow out here. Is that true? No, no, no. no it's, it's, it's really good in the Manhattan city. In Manhattan. In Manhattan, yeah. Okay. Now, how about? Oh, you can't do via. It's carpool, oh, no. right? Yeah. I think yeah, you, I, I think you have to have that, SUV or van. Never joined the SUV. Now, can you, if you go on Juno only, on the Juno app, are you getting consistent requests? Or you have to have both apps to get, you know, your rides filled in? Both have. Okay. So it's not back-to-back -back yet with Juno. It's busy time, like peak hour, you can get the back-to-back -back request uh -huh. from the Juno. After, like, a 12... Like afternoon, you can use the both app get and I just now drop off the get customers. Uh huh. Wow. So you're really them. flipping them around. <laughs> <laughs> you got two phones there. Yeah, is, phones. is there any more hiding? This one for the Juno. Like they, they give me. Juno wants their own phone, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. Collect their own data. Yeah. Uh huh. And the other one has uh, Uber. Own. Are you on Lyft too? No. Why not? The same like Uber. <laughs> It's same shit. The same, the <laughs> yeah, same, it's the same, same shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think that says it all. <laughs> one shit is enough. <laughs> yeah, one is enough. I right. can't. I can't handle the both shit. <laughs> okay. Yeah, a lot of challenges. I hear drivers are striking here on the Uber platform. Yeah, I hear Uber. Um, uh, do you know any drivers who have joined the, the union or trying to be part of the union? Right, there's yeah. supposed to be a union, union drivers yeah. are trying to build up. Uh, are, have you decided to be part of that or you're just going to mind your business and, just, and hang out with Juno for yeah, a bit? Yeah, I just work with the Juno. That's yeah. I don't, I don't want any. <laughs> now, how about and you tipping? also add the tip too. So, the, so oh, we can tip yeah. in so the app. In be the sure app, to yeah. tip this guy at least 25 cents to a 50 cents. I mean, be, be nice. Yeah, okay. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that sounds reasonable. <laughs> you know, I took an airport ride. Uh, uh, I took a. I, I forgot. I should have taken an, a, a Juno ride from the airport, right? So I took an Uber uh -huh. from JFK. From here to JFK? No, from JFK. From to, JFK to, to here to the city. city. It was a hundred and ten dollars. Really? Yeah. How much? They was, only give me. It was wait. It was Excel. It's because Excel I, yeah, okay. yeah, because okay. I had uh, my family, so it was uh -huh. five of us. So I know pool would have been thirty dollars or something like that. Yeah, that is and uh, I think X would have been maybe X forty. Is like forty. Or yeah. Something. How about for Juno? About the same. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Juno is fifty. Yeah, fifty, fifty-five, around fifty or fifty. Now, now Get has a flat rate airport. Do they still have the flat rate? Uh, yeah, they have flat rate. Yeah. For the well, they're flat and, rate. They're flat rate everything, aren't they? Only JFK and LaGuardia and Newark. Uh -huh. Three airports. Yo, so let's talk about this Juno ride. Let's talk about the price breakdown. Let's talk about it all. So earlier today, Mike and I, we were near the Apple store and we were going up 72nd and Broadway, somewhere in that area. And we requested a Juno. Now before I requested a Juno, I looked on the Uber app just to see how much it would cost. Now on the Uber app, the same distance would cost about, I think it was like $20 or something like that. Uber Pool was obviously cheaper, but Mike and I were not interested in taking Uber Pool at the time. 
Now on Juno, since this is my first time using the service, there's a pop-up that I receive, 35% off your ride. So right off the bat, this ride's going to be cheaper on Juno versus Uber. The Juno app works the same exact way the Uber app works. You type in your pickup location and you type in your drop-off location and Juno shows you like a fair estimate. The fair estimate I received was $9 through $12 and the fair came out to be $11.53 and this was, let's see how long this ride was. This ride was 23 minutes. Another cool thing about Juno, drivers can receive tips through the app. So I was able to tip the driver, unlike Uber, you can't tip through the app, which I, I just want Uber someday to just put tipping in the app. Tipping in the app, everyone would love that. Like everyone would love Uber if Uber allowed tipping. But this video ain't about Uber. This video is about my first time using Juno and whatever you do, make sure you stay tuned till tomorrow's video because tomorrow's video is gonna have some footage from this video that you'll just have to watch tomorrow's video to, to understand what I'm talking about. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a good night and see what I'm doing tomorrow. Peace.